Hi, my name is Dave and today I will be demonstrating how to install a pay range relay harness and a blue key pulse on a 30 pound Speed Queen washer. The top cover of the machine has been removed to get access to the power supply from the machine and the coin acceptor. The pay range high voltage power adapter can be connected to any power source between 100 and 240 volts AC. Once a power supply is found, power off the machine. For this machine, the two wires coming out of the fuse board ease the source of the 120 volts AC power supply to splice into. Use the provided splice connectors to connect the 120 volt power supply wires from the machine to the high voltage pay range power adapter. The high voltage pay range power adapter consists of two wires that are not polarity sensitive. So splice either wire to one of the wires from the 120 volt power supply and then splice the second wire from the pay range power adapter to the other 120 volt power supply wire. Please ensure the wires are spliced correctly to ensure proper connectivity. Next, identify the coin acceptor and reference the pay range install guide to determine how to connect the pay range relay harness to various coin acceptors. For this machine, the coin sensor has three wires, a blue, a green, and red but the pay range relay harness will only be spliced to the blue and green wires. The pay range relay harness comes with three wires, blue, yellow, and white. Only the blue and yellow wires will be used, so coil the white wire so it's out of the way. Since the pay range relay harness is also not polarity sensitive, splice the blue wire from the pay range relay harness to either the blue or green wire from the coin switch and then splice the yellow wire from the pay range relay harness to the second wire on the coin switch. Once completed, plug the power supply from the pay range power adapter to the DC jack on the pay range relay module. Go ahead and power the machine on and a blue LED light on the blue key device will confirm the pay range device is receiving power. Final step would be to register the pay range blue key pulse device using the pay range app. 